Presenting Operation M Investigation Check In. This is the weirdest hut in Singapore. It's very moist and it's kept at 16 degrees all year round and it's a perfect thriving environment for fungus growth. It's sprouting from all over the place and there's odd shapes, it's anti-gravity. There's so many of them, there's rows and rows of them and it goes up in stacks. It looks almost like a sci-fi or alien movie. Kind of cool if you ask me. What I've really discovered are chemical-free mushrooms grown locally in Singapore. They need zero sunlight and they're hidden in these darkened huts. Today, we are going to make mushroom leaf burgers. Look, <laughs> that is what we call king oysters. So have you seen this type of shiitake? It's really huge and it smells really gorgeous. You can peel them. For vegetarians, this is your chicken breast meat. You can eat mushrooms raw. Yummy. Do not pick raw mushrooms and eat them if you don't know the species. They could be poisonous. These are oyster mushrooms, really beautiful. You don't wash the mushrooms because they are all spongy, so they take up a lot of water. What you do is just wipe them down with a damp cloth. Most importantly, we're here for the mushrooms. We've got lettuce, fresh tomatoes, local produce, and uh, Chinese parsley, some garlic, some eggs, and we've got boiled potatoes, and a yellow onion, some sliced cheese, some salt, butter, Flour, plain flour, some olive oil, um, any type of olive oil would do, and some pepper, of course. Oh, we've got a guest. This is Sito. Where's the food? Yeah, we've got a really difficult customer here. Where's we the need food? to satisfy his uh, cycling hunger pangs, and he's traveled like 200 kilometers on his bicycle just to witness our uh, cooking. So, let's cook. Brown the garlic, and then we throw in the chopped onions. And I'm going to add in the mushroom three times. You don't toss more than three times. Toss, toss. See, the fourth time things will start coming out. Parsley, look at that. The colors mixing in the, the uh, parsley. So I'm going to season it right now with a little bit of pepper. This is not rock salt, it's just uh, solidified in the freezer. We're making the filling of the burger patty. And that's a little cream mix. Put that back in, so then we can mix it up. We want to introduce some of the little flour. This is the holding agent so that your burger patty doesn't disintegrate while it's being fried. And once we fry this potatoes, it's gonna smell like heaven. <laughs> okay, now my hands are washed. Okay, make sure you do this important step and make sure your fingernails are clean. If you notice, I've just removed my watch. It is very bad, bare-handed cooking with your watch or rings or anything. So if anybody does that, ask them to take it off. Now, this is time to use your hands. Good ball size. Some oil. This is how you test if the uh, oil is well heated. Put a stick or a chopstick in it and the bubbles. Fresh eggs, local produce. This is going to act as a uh, sealant, kind of like an activator to make a good crust, golden brown. And then put it in. What you want to do is press it down, make a good thick patty. So, okay, my pan is pretty small, so it will take. Three nice fist-sized patties. I'm gonna turn it now. Look at that. Just look at that. Okay, I'm gonna pan the dressing on the outside of the patty. Put this in. Now this cheese idea is uh, Mr. Sito's addition. He requested for this, so we're so gonna do, do a, a viewer's request. And you just wanna add a big chunk of wheel there. And now we wrap. Fold it in, fold it in, skewer it, and there you have it. Mushroom leaf burger. Mm. Really? Uh, really? Nice. Really? Yeah. Thank you. Bye bye. How's this for a table setting? Hey, investigation is checked out. Our mission has been compromised. <laughs> there are too many people gathering around. <laughs>
Even this guy from 200 kilometers away knows to explain. <laughs> <laughs> Come now to eat. What investigation? Investigation, not.